Hello people, Lion30 and welcome back to Kingdom of Heaven here at Crusader Kings 3. In the last video a lot of things went wrong for us. We lost our marshal, we need to ransom our son to get him back and also my second son. That's a lot of money which I currently actually don't have. So hopefully he is just a kid. I cannot fabricate hooks on him. And I wouldn't like him to have a hook on me. What I could try and do is murder the guy. Yes, because then this guy is going to become the king and I have a hook on him. <coughs> Pardon me. And if that happens, we can potentially get him to release my son. Yes, it might actually happen. It actually might be a good way to go about it. Is there anyone that I potentially could invite? No. But we are potentially getting to be able to kill that guy, hopefully. Also, as someone very correctly said, I could potentially ask my wife to convert to my religion, which I'm going to do. I don't really know why I haven't done it already, but I am a bit stupid sometimes, so that's probably probably the reason I could try and seduce my my wife but I'm not gonna do that right now how old is she 44 I'm 43 I'm actually a bit old it's already been a lot of years happening inside the game because I've been running at speed 5 I might potentially slow it down a bit Ras or peasant high or low it doesn't matter in the end we are all mortals. I was reminded of this as I woke coughing in the early morning hours a dull age pounding through my head and throat. You seem to be under the weather, my lord. I know a fair number of suitable remedies. My wife. She is a court physician and she's kind of decent, but do be a bit careful about it. <coughs> Pardon me again. Relax your breathing, my wife instructed me. The feather in her hand looked almost a feral as she began to gently brush me under my nose. Evil begone, she urged as I sneezed loudly. <laughs> okay, that's a bit weird. The strange tickling turned out to be just what I needed. For now, the worst of my symptoms are alleviated and the world seems a little brighter. Awesome, I would like to die, so... I would like to stay alive. I would love to be your spy master, my lord. And also, I would love to kill this guy. So I can get my son back. Because I do have a hook on that other guy. Because I cannot, as I said, pay for this thing. And I do not have the prestige needed to claim this guy's title. I could beat him in a war. If I only had like a normal claim on him. That is something to keep in mind, of course. Okay, we, we are being attacked by our neighbors for Tigre. Which thankfully is not one of my places. That's a good thing. But actually, that's a good idea. You, my man, fabricate a claim on my leech. I want to take his county if possible. He's really weak. I could easily beat him in a war if I need to. And then I could take that place. And then he might just have to give us the title if, if possible. Murder Secret Tunnel. Sure. Yeah, because this guy is actually too strong for us to beat, even though he has the Jewish place. We can join a grand tournament. Greeting Rastavita Dembia. I'm organizing a grand tournament in Gesira. We will start with the horse race contest. It should be quite a spectacle. The prize will be a good quality should the opportunity for personal glory not be enough to entice you. Okay, sure, we go for this tournament. I actually haven't done this thing before. It's the first time I've ever done it. Caravan Master. Total travel time, five months. Medium chance of danger. Seven in entourage. Higher experienced captain. Higher mercenary guard. This is actually a bit interesting. If I hire these mercenaries, that's gonna he's gonna make things.
Okay. We have five safety. If I hire a caravan master. Okay. What would that change? No one needs the requirements. Okay. Select travel options. Customize route. We are going to be walking through what? Drylands, drylands, drylands. A lot of drylands. Is there anyone here good with drylands? Wetlands, floodplains, drylands. That's only two gold. That's fine with me. Okay, we're gonna go with that one. We're gonna join his grand tournament. And hopefully that works out for us. This is a bit interesting. I actually haven't played with this new DLC, so. Grand tournament, a tentative start. My fellow attendees is hosting a grand tournament competition in the vicinity of Gesira and time has come for us to depart. While my alien body is affecting my health, I shall be damned if I will not attend this. What promises to be a spectacular event spoken about for years to come. I suppose we must. Yeah, sure. I feel like that's fine. Travel, grotesque creatures. I rarely see my champion this excited before. His eye seems to be devouring a richly adorned book. Sometimes I manage to take a peek at the maps on its interior. One morning he finally approaches me about his findings. My liege, there are rumors that in the land of Vegera is home to extraordinary people. It is said that Polemia, headless people who have their faces on their chest, wander these cities. You will keep searching for the creatures. Grotesque rush. Travel safety. Tell me more. Learning. You will keep searching for these creatures. I feel like they're not going to be any. Tell me more about them. Keep it up for now. What just happened? Is there a reason why that person stopped to be of help to me? I don't have the money to bribe him. Right. What I potentially want to do right now is go for this one. Because I think I need it to make this thing happen at this moment in time. We are getting closer though, so that's a good thing for us. To this grand tournament and nothing has happened. Tournament arrival! We ha I have arrived at the site of the tournament here in Yesira. Though not all the re revelers have yet arrived, Throngs of people wandered through the colorful surroundings, all looking forward to the forthcoming displays of skills and prowess. There is no time to lose, I must begin preparing. I must be a victor at absolutely any cost. Can't wait for it to start. Your intent is... Triumph. Okay, recruits. You seek to improve your court with new and powerful knights. Okay, seduce, befriend. I don't feel like my guy is good enough to win anything. He's not particularly good at martial, especially now, not now being ill. The prowess is really going down because of that. So I think what I'm... My intent... I want to recruit knights, actually. I want better knights for my court. We're waiting for the horse race. This is actually... I, I have not seen this before. Enter tent camp. The warmth of the forge is enough to keep most guests away. When I open the door I find the farrier yawning over her work table. Not many seem to have approached her. She quickly straightens, clears her throat with an audible cough. May I help you? I can offer you the best horseshoes ready for the tournament, she suggests. Increases greatly. Qualification. You have five. I see. Oh, I think I just made a mistake.
The finest horses in Jazeera adorned in the colors of their owners are led around the track as the Herald announces, announces the Countess com, Commencement has the looter. Oh, okay. The riders mill around as they wait for the beast to arrive, some stretching, some eyeing, eyeing each other up. My fastest horse, Moncosa, has not gone unnoticed by the breeders and gamblers. They have a bet to place. No. This will be quite a race. My horse is all set, of course, but the beast is nothing without capable riders to control it. As a result, I find myself with three potential riders arrayed before me all clamoring for the honor of being allowed to represent me. The first is my champion, Kafa, a fair candidate considering his experience handling horses in his profession. He is not particularly good. Bekele, Kafa, or this person. Kafa is decent. Bekele is not particularly good. I think I'm gonna go with Kafa. As the Lord made him, as the horses make ready to race, the entire crowd is cheering and chanting for their favorite racer. That is, until they collect collectively gasp before growing completely silent. A naked man has run onto the tracks and is flaunting everything that the Lord gave him from tip to toe. The crowd promptly begins booing this impulsive creature and hurling anything they can to get their hands at him. I could imprison Michael. Ooh. You know what? Michael, my man. I would like to recruit you. Disgusting. I'm going to arrest that guy. I want him in my court. Watching Rastman as rider stride the steed is much like watching a boulder roll over a village square. They ride like an absolute lunatic, and unfortunately my own rider has fallen victim to the violent and clumsy racing. With an agonized whinny and a hard painful crunch, my horse is battered into the wall of the track, and I'm certain Kafa's leg is damaged. This obviously breaks the rule. You convince the judge to penalize the jockey. It seems like that's going to happen. And Ras Mesa is knocked out of the horse racing content. Yeah, he was knocked out. The horses continue to thunder around the course, the remaining riders sobbing at the steed's reins to urge them ever faster. It has been an eventful race already, I think, remembering when my horse was bas bashed into my competitor's horse. There's only one more lap to go. I lean over the edges of the stand and shout down at my rider as the pack passes. That animation is actually laughable. I just want to say that to you. Extra pay if you win. Combine martial and stewardship challenge. Hit them in the face. Go faster. I'm going to probably go for the best one, which seems to actually be this one. Go faster. It is hard to see if my advice made any difference, and all the horses round the final bend into the home straight in something of a clump. My horse is bolting free of the chasing pack. If it can't hold off my rivals, we will win. The crowd reaches a crescendo. The riders urge their steeds on in unison. The finish line looms. One more push. I am no longer ill. That's good. Oh, what just happened? Count Daid's horse crosses the line as the crowd erupts, closely followed by Rasmus Curry's swift bolt and not that person. We didn't even place, so I will have to be better prepared next time. Okay. There's always next time. We are waiting for the ceremony to begin. Temple, pray. Tavern. Okay. Uh, okay, there is a basis for the claim though, so I don't care. 
The sun comes down on the final day of the tournament and the mass crowds begins to disperse. I find myself ruminating over the result. That person won. I was unable to find any good candidates to join the ranks of my champions. I will look forward to the next one. Yeah, sure. And... A child lost in the forest. We could try. Finish the grand tournament. We did... Actually gain this one prisoner though. If I'm looking at the right place, which I'm not. Man, it was a long time ago. There we go. Michael, I would like my man to negotiate your release. If I recruit you and demand your conversion, yeah, I'm gonna release you. I need you as a, as a champion. Right, Nigis Sheba is dead. The search went long into the night before it was called off and reconvened at dawn. It was only then that the body was found, bloodied, mangled, and torn after an attack by some vicious, hungry beast. At least I hope it was the beast doing. Thankfully, everyone agrees it's a terrible tragedy, and my involvement and existence of any scheme remains unknown. I gain critical stress, though. I swear to the Lord, I will punish someone. Uh, no, I'm as good as anyone else. Okay, so I'm actually I would like you to be my chancellor again. Yeah, swap. And then I would like that new guy. I'm gonna give him a few seconds. Because I'm I think I'm still waiting for him to be Michael is dear to me. No, I'm gonna keep him until I'm able to recruit him. We could ask for pardon. All oh, right. What I want to do though is actually, I want my son. Not that one, I want the good one. Oh, my, my important one. User hook. on you. I I'm not paying. Am I? No, I'm not paying. I don't think I'm paying. I shouldn't be paying. Yeah, he accepted my demands and now I want him to be my new marshal. He's a bit lustful. So I'm gonna assign him to marshal. And now everything looks actually kind of decent again. I'm gonna do that one. I accept the ransom offer. Thank you. And my son needs to get married again, actually. So this time I'm gonna go for someone with good stats, like Del Ruba. Send proposal. There we go. And I actually would like to get uh, Phineas back as well. I'm gonna pay 10 gold and get that guy back. I Why did I have to pay? I feel like that's bugged out. I used a hook on him. I shouldn't have to pay then. That's stupid. That is really stupid. An imposing man is standing on the road ahead of us. I'm Kuriakos of Senar. I have bested dozens of men in combat. And honestly, all those fights were dull. So here I am on this road looking for someone better than me, someone I can learn from. If you can best me in combat, I will become a valuable and loyal servant. And so, on this day, I demand to meet one of you in a fair fight. You are not particularly good, Kuriakos. I am not interested in you. I would gain prestige, though, if we gain this guy. We are already... I'm gonna try to win. He won. That's a bit stupid. Okay. And we lost all of that money because for some reason I paid for the ransom even though I shouldn't pay for it. That's a bit stupid if you ask me. That's really stupid actually if you ask me. We have arrived at home. It took 174 days. 
but we are finally home again. And whenever I get a claim on my leech, which I actually can't pay for, I'm gonna attack him and take that county from him. Yes, I will. Which is going to be fine. He is capable of speaking Arabic now. Mysteries of the Orit. My daughter Miriam and her little friend Hanukkah had taken a copy from the Orit from the study and brought it to the player room. They spent hours trying to understand what was written on its pages, talking about the Lord and the many mysteries of the divine. She seems to have developed deep respect for the words of the Haimanat faith. She could be humble. I actually would like that. That's a good trait. Thank you, kid. Stay humble. Neighboring ruler won a war, okay? Right. I don't think I can pay for this thing whenever I get it, but we're gonna go into the red probably because I lost all of that money. It actually makes me a bit upset that I lost that money. I would like to get it back. Hunter's lodges are built, that's a good thing. We could designate the guardian for Phineas. He is going for what? Intrigue education. Right. I could probably do this myself. Send proposal. Yes, I will. How old am I? 45. I am a Hasteluder. Search for physician, search for caravan master, invite champions. See it done. I lose 87 gold. I'm gonna actually have to wait. I can't pay for this right now. I'm gonna try it again. 15 months. Just because I lost that money, that's the only reason why this happened. So, I'm sorry guys, there's not a lot of things you can do about it. Sometimes those things happened. Happens, rather. You are a twin, you are going for learning education, that's fine by me. My wife can help you. Yes, she can. You can pardon criminals, you can imprison criminals. What have they done? They're fornicators. I see no reason to do so. I cannot actually replace you with anyone better as well, so it doesn't really matter. No, it doesn't really. I don't know what I'm doing, man. Offer guardianship? No. Decline. Right, I'm still actually going for stewardship. Can use the extort subject's decision. I actually like that one. That's a lot of money. Now we're gonna go back for scheming again. I think. Thinking about that, extort sub subjects. Thinking about that, fabricating claims on people means I could extort them for money. If they have money. Oh, I already tried to do that, of course. I'm gonna try and fabricate a hook on you then, if I can, potentially. Yes? So I'm gonna gain some money, money from doing so, hopefully. And then I'm gonna get... Why was he burned? Oh, he was burned to death in that siege. Of course he was. Because I am being attacked by this person attacking us. Or he's only raiding. Or is he? We are losing this war. My leech has the fail to defend the settlement of Kosege from the ravages of Emir Sinder, and with his fall, fall goes a key fortification for Great Semyon. Even now, his troops swarm across the countryside. I will avenge this slight. Yeah, sure. And now I'm getting sieged down, and I might potentially lose people again. He's actually in jail. Stop this war! Oh, he's only raiding me now. Oh, man. No, that makes me so mad. I hate when those things happen. Stupid. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Really, really stupid. That is crippling my income. See it then. I want the money. I, I want the claim. I am losing a lot of money. I know. Send in the entertainers. You spend, you get a weak hook. Sure. 
now I can demand payment. I'm going to do so and I'm going to get out of being in debt. That's really good. Now, my leech, I'm actually going to let this finish first. The sermon. Today Nagasa held a fiery ceremony for all of the children of the court. They were apparently spellbound as they zealously read from the Orit. My daughter seemed to take it to heart, perhaps a little too much. She has been hounding the servants for hours since, pointing out how they can be better Haimana. She could be sell it. I actually don't want critical stress. Being a sell it is not a bad thing per se, and she's not going to be the one in charge. So be a sell it, my dear. Um... Who are you at war with you this time? It's a fear tyranny war or whatever you want to call it. There's a lot of people running around right now. Which is not particularly good, but what can you do about it? A visiting eunuch. A traveling eunuch is presenting himself at my court today. Greeting almost serene Ras, he says respectfully. My name is Maximus, a wanderer of repute. I had lent my knowledge to noble scholar kings and tended to harems of great sultans, and now I'm here offering my services to you. 100% yes, I love you, my man. He's incredible. He is really, really good. The reason I'm wondering about steward is because I would like a good steward. But uh, he's really good. He could be my spy master, I guess, but he's going to be my chancellor at this moment. Yes, he is. How close are you? He's finished. Okay, he's probably going for that diplomacy thing, I think. You are now going to increase control in Semyon. And I also want to be able to get money from other people. So could I fabricate a hook on you? Yes, I could. And now, my leech, you're actually having an ally who at this moment is fighting against our leech. So I'm going to wait for a moment to see what happens in that war. He's being raided by that guy. Oh, curses. I should probably end that thing and go for another person. Preferably one with money. Who might that be then? Is that an independent person? It is. Fabricate hook. Yes, we can. I'm trading prestige for money, but I need that money more than I need the prestige at this moment in time. So that's basically the reason. That is basically the reason. Oh! She died in jail and I didn't know about it. And I am overwhelmed by stress. I could be a confider. Yeah, I, I want to be a confider. A little experimentation. Oh, that's really bad for my health. A long evening of state business with Gideon has slowly degenerated into both of us being deep in our cups, slurringly swapping saucy stories. I have just finished my retelling of a tale involving three electrous cohens and an extremely worn felt hat when I see the untoward gleam in my companion's eye. Thoughts of blackmail race unbidden to my mind. He's a deviant. I, I want to be friend with my son. I didn't know the fact that she was in jail. Since when? Since when was Giudina in jail? Sure. I didn't know about it. I did not know about it. Your ally, by the way, has a lot of soldiers at this moment in time. And I think that's mainly because he's actually having those mercenaries. Yes, it is. Disrupt schemes. Find secrets. Kidnapper. Digging for dirt, I think. 
Because I want to beat this guy in war. But if, have, if he has that ally, then it's going to be a problem for us. Things are not really going my way at this moment in time. It really isn't. But that's just the thing that makes things fun, I think. <laughs> Having a bit of a challenge, you know. I just lost my steward. <laughs> Forget everything that I just said. <laughs> Forget everything that I just said. Things are not really working out for us at this moment in time. I'm, I'm just saying, things are really not working out for us. I will find out what he is hiding. I'm not going to be discovered. He surprised me with the gift. That's good. Thank you, Gideon. Oh, he gave me 50 gold. Thank you, kid. I love that. That's, that's awesome. What are the cost of mercenaries these days? A lot more than 50 gold, as we can see. My man, are you going to keep on to those mercenaries for a long time? Why is he being attacked? For the county of Angoth, which is that guy. That's actually really good for us. As long as he siege down that guy and he loses all of his troops. That's a good thing for us. Phineas will be sell it. Yeah, I don't want to be more unhappy with myself than I already am. I have gout. They call it the disease of kings as if there was something luxurious or en enviable about my swollen aged king joints. When my pains reach their peak, I cannot help but wish I had been born a simple peasant. You might have my sympathies, my lord. I have a few ideas which might lessen the symptoms of your gout. Be careful. Excellent work. I might actually die soon. I'm feeling fine though, so that's something I guess. He will not be able to raise his troops really. He will not be able to walk past this guy. I don't want to be uh, fighting with this guy though, by mistake. That's the only issue. I would like him to move away a bit. Hopefully it's not going to try and siege me down. I'm a bit tired of being sieged down. What in the world was my daughter doing in that wardrobe in the servants' quarters? Playing hide and seek, she claims. She looks like a ghost, shaking, eyes wide open, staring at walls. Oh no, I know what happened. She must have seen two of the launderers um, plucking a rooster together. The poor girl looks shocked. I would not be surprised if she will find intimacy difficult when she grows up. She is going to be chased. Fine, she's going to be chased. I can, I can live with that. Send in the entertainers. I gain a hook. And now I gain some money. Thank you. That is good for us. Now, man, I want your money. If possible. I'm going to wait and see what these people do. Before I try and do anything. He's going to walk in that direction. I'm going to actually attack this guy. Or will I? This guy still has all of those troops. That's the issue. Why are you still having all of those? Ally dude, why do you have all of these mercenaries still hired? Shouldn't they eat up your money or something? Someone is trying to kill my marshal. Well, that, that's good to know. Hmm. Find secrets, disrupt schemes. I'm not trying to disrupt the schemes. Geodina is of age, they grow up so fast. My intelligent little girl. I want a matrilineal marriage to someone. Preferably not someone already in my place. That's a city. Anyone who's good? He's actually decent. Do we have anyone good at diplomacy? He's a bit old though. I could remarry her if he dies. Yeah, sure. I'm gonna marry you to her, to him then. And now, I am actually going to take a break, guys. Things have been a bit of hit or miss, but I feel like 
we are very soon going to attack this guy for that claim that we have on him and take that county. I'm just going to wait a bit and see what happens with this war and stuff. And then we're going to attack that person. Actually, these people are already hired for how long? It's by that guy. But how long until he's still not, he's not having them anymore? It's three years. That's a long time. Okay. Make sure to like this video if you haven't enjoyed, guys. Also like, yeah, like this video. I said that already. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already so you don't miss out on any future uploads. Also leave a comment down below if there's something that you want to talk about. But thanks for watching, guys. See you soon. Bye.